The city is bidding farewell to summer with its long-standing tradition, the Naperville JC's annual Last Fling. The four-day fundraising event hosted along Jackson Avenue in downtown Naperville kicked off Friday afternoon. We come together, we have a big party at the end of the summer, and we have bands, we have a carnival, we have a business expo, we have special events, we have a Labor Day parade, and we hope to raise a lot of money to give back to local nonprofits. A big focus this year is the music lineup, which features a wide range of tunes from 80s throwback groups to 90s pop, acoustic performances, and some classic rock and roll. Like I said, there's a little bit of something for everyone as far as entertainment is concerned. Alongside the music are several family fun activities, including carnival rides for all ages. Favorites like the Freak Out and Zero Gravity have returned for those who dare to step on, while the carnival train and teacups are also available for a smoother ride. Other activities include carnival games, karate demonstrations, giant slides, and more. We've always made sure with our carnival partners to make sure that there's a variety for everybody to enjoy. <laughs> As in past years, there's no shortage of food and beverage options at the fling, from carnival food and burgers to lemonade and adult drinks. New this year is Nautical Bowls, a superfood smoothie franchise that opened in Naperville in 2023. Being out in the community, getting involved with the community, and also showcasing our delicious food that's also healthy for you is great. The last fling weekend culminates in the Labor Day Parade on Monday, September 2nd at 10 a.m. by Naperville North High School. This year's parade is extra special as the Naperville JCs will pay tribute to founding member and Junior Chamber International Senator Al DeGeter. The group will be collecting donations for the Pulmonary Fibrosis Foundation, a request from the DeGeter family. He was always here supporting us, supporting the organization, helping coach new members, making them feel welcome. He was just our biggest cheerleader and it was just the least that we could do to show him uh, how much we appreciate everything that he did for our organization and really to honor him and honor his family. Tegeter was well known by the community for his volunteerism, a service that the Naperville JCs appreciates from all its members. It takes a village, literally, to put together an event like this. It's the people in the Naperville JCs and supporting organizations who make the last fling a summer closing staple in Naperville. We love Naperville Last Fling! Yeah! For Naperville News 17, I'm Jesus Cortez. Oh, say, can you see by the dawn's early light? Oh, it's so bright.